Hey, what's going on YouTube, and welcome back to part 38 of Persona 5 Royal. It's been a couple days since I played, but I'm pretty sure we, uh, kind of met Futaba for the first time. And Morgana's nowhere to be found. Not something I'm complaining about, by the way. <laughs> oh, there she is. Were you just going to go to sleep without even wondering where I was? I take it the Chief told you about Futaba, and then you guys disbanded in relief for now? Something like that. Hmm. You can't underestimate my intel gathering skills, you know. I was checking out the chief's house. I didn't think our Alibaba would be so young. Uh, well... What? We saw her, Joker. What are you, what are you talking about, well, man? She's probably about the same age as you guys. At least her voice was pretty young sounding. Oh, and she had long hair, too. At the very least, she's surely no amateur. She completely overheard your conversation with the chief. And she can hack into our chats, too. Even if she can't take Medjed down directly, she might have some kind of lead on them. Hmm. Sounds like a party member. Case, we'll need to rely on Futaba to get closer to Medjed. Well, let's meet up again tomorrow. How about we do it in here? It's way too hot outside. True. It's like 100 degrees here today. Anyway, make sure you let everyone know. Uh, that's about like 40 degrees Celsius for you uh, non-Americans. I think. Wait, what have we seen say for? Futaba Sakura? She had one of these palaces? Hold on. While Medjid was targeting you, you chose to deal with someone completely unrelated to them? Then how was Medjid... Nani? What you said about the Sakura family generally falls in line with our investigation. It appears you aren't feeding us a false testimony. Oh, really? You just figured that out now? <laughs> for real. <laughs> if you're lucid enough for jabs, you can get back to your story. It's still unclear to us as to how the Phantom Thieves dealt with Medjed since their identity is unknown. If you tell me something coherent, I may be a little more willing to believe you. You guys ever get that thing, by the way, where you get that ringing in your ears? I think I need to lay off the headphones for a bit or something. All right. Still, to think the Phantom Thieves would have their hideout in the home of Wakaba Ishiki's daughter. <laughs> what a coincidence. No. Perhaps it's fate. Regardless, we don't have time to waste. Continue with your story. Hmm. I actually really like this palace. And the story that comes with it is super unique, too. Seriously? I can't. Hmm. Always gossipers. <sighs> yep. This when I wanted to relax on my summer break. Well, that, ain't, that ain't happening. I already did my exams, right? Yeah. Bro, I had one exam this week that was just like, bleh. Man, that assembly had me bored to tears. It was one of those ones where if you ever have multiple choice questions and it's like, every single multiple choice question, there was E and it was all of the above, or uh, uh, none of these are correct. So you were constantly guessing yourself. Huh? Did you have school too, Yusuke? I'm doing laundry, so these are the only clothes I had to wear. You really should buy a couple more outfits. He's an artist, he can't afford that shit. Come now, we didn't gather here to make small talk, now did we? Let's get to Alibaba's case. Well then, I'll start. 
It looks like Futaba was listening in on LeBlanc. But why would she want to listen in on the cafe? I have no idea. It's just like Boss said. She's a tough nut to crack. In any case, her hacking skills will be absolutely necessary if we wish to stand up to Medjad. Going by what she has told us, we may even be able to identify who they are. We'll have to trust in her skills for now, then. How so appealing those Big Bang Burger bags look? You just want a burger. Anyway, we found out that Futaba has a palace. But can someone who isn't evil have one? That doesn't matter. A palace is the materialization of distorted cognitions brought about by strong desires. That's all. It just so happens that a lot of warped people turn out evil. She's so young, though. Pain she's gone through must be the cause of her distortion. Maybe that has something to do with why she calls herself Alibaba. Chinese Amazon? According to the Chief's story, Futaba has auditory and visual hallucinations, right? There's a chance those are related to some important memories she's holding. It's hard to explain, but those memories may have been warped by the distortions. Basically, we just gotta steal her treasure, right? Well, yeah. Well, yeah. So do we all agree about taking on Futaba's palace? She's asked us to do so. I don't think that part is an issue. If we heal Futaba's heart, it will not only help Boss, but she can then assist us with Medjed. I agree. I've been wondering about how Boss said a lot happened after Futaba's mom died too. Hold on a second. Our investigation of her palace may not go like anything we've done up to this point. Why is that? Well, uh, you'll see. Having an individual ask you to steal their heart is an extremely irregular case. There's no telling what the palace ruler's disposition will be like, or the distortion that'll be there. We may run into some unforeseen situations. Oopsie. Um, well, it's not really up to me now, is it? All right. Let's just make sure we're cautious. Well, let's get cracking on those keywords, huh? The ones we have at the moment are Futaba Sakura and Sojiro Sakura's house. We got the who and the where, so all that's left is the what, right? Let us try going to their house first. Boss is busy running the cafe, isn't he? We should make sure he doesn't suspect anything. Hmm. Important memories, huh? I'll be able to remember everything if I turn back into a human, right? Also, why do you have the window open? That just makes it hotter. <laughs> that has to be the case. I definitely want this mission to succeed. If we can retrieve Futaba's memories, then I bet we can get mine back too. In any case, it's not every day you stumble upon a hacker like her around. You really do have a gift, don't you? Yeah, gift. Definitely not an old man talking to me in a velvet room. You sure live up to my expectations. Ooh, level up. Allows you to craft all infiltration tools? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. What? All right. That sounds awesome. Hey, they went on without us. Let's hurry and catch up to them. Now, the last keyword. She's a shut-in, so we just gotta figure out what she thinks her house is. If she can't get out, maybe a prison? Perhaps a labyrinth with an unknown exit. I remember what this one is, but I never understood why. Maybe an oasis? Nothing so far. In that case, how about hell? We don't have nearly enough clues. If only we could ask her directly. We can! Come on, let's go see Futaba. But knock, what knock, would we bitch. say to get in? What do you mean? We're sneaking in. You have to be joking. Won't the door be locked for sure this time? Eh, bust it open. I'll take care of that. Oh, and I figured out where Futaba's room was when I snuck in last night. What if we run into boss, though? 
There's no way we'll be able to avoid his questions. It must be 85 degrees in this room right now, and it's like 10 a.m. He's at work now, so I think we should be fine. It is so hot. Oh, getting cold feet, Makoto? Don't worry, it'll be nothing. We've gone through loads of shit like this already. This is our only choice, right? I suppose Futaba did get in contact with him. Perhaps she'll at least be willing to speak with him? Of course she will. I'm the main character. Very well. Let's do this. This is Futaba's room. Looks like my room. Futaba-chan! You're in there, right? There's no answer. Futaba-chan! Are you there? I'm sorry for being startled and screaming yesterday. It was so dark that I got scared. No reaction whatsoever. Ah, this is gonna be hard. You're listening, right, Alibaba? Ring, is ring. Alibaba? Why is she only reacting to that name? You're Futaba Sakura, aren't you? She's not responding again. Does she not like us saying her name? We don't have time to dally around. We need her keyword before dealing with Alibaba's identity. We want to learn more about you. If we don't do so, we can't steal your heart. The reason why we came here is because we need the keyword to enter your palace. That's why we want to talk with Futaba Sakura herself, and not Alibaba. I think Alibaba's a cool name. You don't have to show yourself. Just answer some questions for us. Chat messages are fine. <laughs> it's like dealing with a neat. All right then. Our leader, the guy who lives in LeBlanc's attic, wants to speak with you. We're counting on you. Try and get a keyword out of her. Hmm. How is living in this house? Looks like you should ask something different. Okay. Looks like you- Alright, fine. The joke's on you guys, I just wanted to go through all the, uh, choices. 100 IQ. What? Die? Tomb. Tomb? You think that's it? Try entering tomb! Input accepted. Searching for route to destination. We got it! Hell yeah. Yes. It was plenty. You haven't forgotten your promise of helping us if we complete your request, right? Well then, let's hurry up and go. And clicky. Clicky. You idiot! Don't activate it here! What's a big deal? Oh yeah, she's like right next to us. <laughs> Oopsie. It's a desert. Yeah, we see that. Wait, what the... Are our clothes are still the same? Futaba herself is asking us to steal her heart. It'd be odd if she saw us as a threat. If she doesn't see us as an enemy, then your clothes don't change. That's how it works. But more importantly, I told you to be cautious. Why'd you activate it like that? Is that why we ended up in a desert? Where's the tomb? Oh, it's so damn hot here. Yeah, join the club, man. Even though we entered right in front of her room, we didn't end up inside it. She must really want to keep people away from her. Mm, I see. Hmm. What a bleak feeling this place has. It's the complete opposite of Kaneshiro's bank. Let's hurry up and get going. Where's the palace? Is it that way? 
Oh yeah, there's something shiny. Pyramid. A tomb in the desert. I see. A river in the desert? Anyway, let's make our way there. Isn't that kind of far? Are we gonna walk? No, turn into uh, the van thingy. Of course not. My paws will get burned. I've been waiting for this. I'll make sure to put the AC on full blast. You're so considerate. Wait, how is this thing powered? <laughs> right. All right, let's roll. Kind of wondered that. Ugh. Beats opening the windows to the hot desert air. Hey, On, can I have a drink? Didn't you have mineral water? I drank it already. How are the guys? Oh. <laughs> That's the first cutscene in a while since, uh... It's so hot. Uh, actually, no, it's not. I forgot about the firework one. That's a good one, though. The AC ain't working at all. What the hell was that lukewarm air about? That was the best I could do, so quit your yapping. For real? You are so half-assed. What was that? You wanna fight, punk? Jeez, shut up. It's hot, so don't make me more irritated. <sighs> to think her palace would be a pyramid. Or shadow. Hey, a pyramid's a tomb, right? Oh, this palace also has a bangin' soundtrack. Bangin'. Yes, it's a pharaoh's tomb. That's how it's mostly known. There are a variety of theories on it. For instance, it's even said to be a device for reviving the dead. Reviving the dead, hmm? It's beautiful nonetheless. It's perfectly conformed to the golden ratio. Hey guys, can we go in already? I'm gonna melt. I'm not even kidding you, sweat is dripping off my, my face right now. Oh man. My computer's probably crying. Maybe this is like a roleplay episode, you know? I put myself in an extremely hot climate, and uh, yeah, it all, it all comes together. I can see it. Whee! Oh, come on. I wanna go on the ride. Indeed. Yes. Okay. Yes. It's somewhere. Ah, oh, the soundtrack's good. I guess we won't fight any shadows in this place, right guys? Obviously. This is just an exploration palace. Treasure already? 
Hell yeah. Let's go. I can see it. <laughs> yeah, this is easy mode. Hey. Hmm. Hey. Yeah. Yep. Hey, look who it is. Futaba's shadow. It isn't the real her. Oh yeah, you've seen her face. True, this one's kind of dressed like a queen. So you're Futaba Sakura. <sighs> Creepy. Hey, where's the treasure? It's doubtful that you wouldn't know where it is. Hey, say something! Don't be like that! I'm sorry, Futaba-chan. It's okay, there's no need to be scared. So, can you tell us where your most treasured possession is? This is going nowhere. Let's just leave her. Will you guys shut up for a bit? Nice patience. Those who plunder my tomb, why have you come? She talked, but... What are you saying? You want us to steal it, right? If you believe you can steal it, then try as you might. That's rather defiant sounding. Spooky. Perhaps this is that Sundere thing where someone is harsh or sweet depending on the mood. I know someone like that. Considering the state that my palace is in, there is no way that you can steal it. Creepy child. You killed her! You're a plague! What are these voices? Murderer! Why don't you say something? Murderer? You're the one who killed it's her! It's all your fault! This is horrible. Hey, the hell is this? Don't come don't near me! Don't just stand there! Say something! It's your fault! Murderer! That's, That's right. right. I did it. What? I am the one who killed my mother. Uh, let's leave. <laughs> what was that? Uh, let's get out of here. My mother exists here. I will remain here. I will do so until I die. <laughs> Our clothes. She sees us as a threat now. What's going on? Dun, dun, dun. Who says this to a kid, though? Like, let's be honest. What the fuck? This place is a tomb. I'll die here. That's right. Die! Don't come near me! Don't just stand there! Say something! It's your fault! No! Someone help me! Damn it! What the hell? This is bad. I'm having a hard time getting a grasp of our situation. We should regroup and... What now? Oh, crap. Ben, ben, ben. Resident Evil 4. This is good. Wait. At least we got this good soundtrack. Yeah, let's boogie. You're right. Get the fuck out. Yeah, see what I mean by this palace? You'll see, this palace is probably like the best designed one, in my opinion. Not necessarily the most the date fun, that though. The Medjid is set for the alleged cleanse is 821. That day is fast approaching. The Phantom Thieves, whom they singled out, have not made any notable actions at this time. Will Medjid carry out their cyber-terrorism? 
In order to stop them, we need to help Futaba Sakura before the 21st. Our deadline is about two days prior, so the 19th. Meeting up in Shibuya, then coming here is a pain, right? Let's make this place our hideout for a while. Hmm, yeah. Is everyone fine with this place being our next hideout then? We must take care not to be discovered by boss. There's no telling what may happen inside that pyramid. We all need to be cautious so that place doesn't become our graveyard. Man, this is gonna be one crazy summer vacation. Eh, we'll get it done in three days. We're dealing with international hackers and looking for a treasure in a pyramid. How can you be enjoying this? This is a crisis of whether or not our group continues on, you know? I know that. That reminds me. While we were in the Mona car, you were staring at me with a dirty look, you perv. Ryuchi, how could you? Shut up. It was a great view. You guys were looking too, am I right? Indeed. The pyramid's <laughs> golden ratio was truly a sight to behold. Mm, yes, the, the pyramid. That ain't what I'm talking about. I wasn't staring, Lady On. I'm a gentleman, after all. And you couldn't either. It's not that you weren't, but that you couldn't since you were transformed, am I right? <sighs> Will we be alright like this? Alright. Café Le Blanc is our no hideout. Excellent. Not again! Uh, she's supposed to be talking. How many monitors does she have? I wouldn't mind a little hacker friend that could, you know, just do whatever the hell he wanted. The sight of her palace bothers me too. We have to do this. Yes, yes. Luckily, this is a rather fun palace. What? strikes again. Was that Alibaba proving what she said earlier? Talk about a crazy thing to pull off. Yeah, I, I was having some hardware issues earlier and I was just like, I don't know about you guys, I'm a rather calm person, but whenever technology stops working, I get very, very angry. Like, very angry. Okay. Right, how many do I have? Eighteen. What's up? Oh wait, we have new. Wait, we have new. Uh. Oh, perma pick. Oh, I feel like a dunce now. God damn it! This is a chance of encountering. Oh, that sounds good. All right, we need silk yarn though. Happy bomb. What's up? Uh, let's see if we can go buy stuff from that old man. Because I know he sells some yarn. I can see it. Hey. Okay, never mind. I didn't want to anyway. It's somewhere. Okay. 
All right, let's make the treasure demon because I really need some money. Yeah. Yeah, let's pay 5,000 yen for one treasure trap. Fucking Popega. Um. Now these are that great. Let's get two of those. Yeah. If I remember right, the, the uh, shadows in this palace are weak to, uh, I think, curse or bless. I wish I had more materials, so well. Hmm. Yeah. We might as well make a couple of these. Sure. Yeah. I don't want to waste my time, that's all. So I want to be as efficient as possible with what I make. Should be good. So apparently, treasure demon um, crafting is really good. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know just how much it upgrades your chance by, but probably a little bit. Well then. Probably at least like twenty percent or something. That would be nice. Oh, it's hot. Let's go now. Let's just get that shit started. Holy shit, five people want to hang out? Look at everybody. Hey, you want to hang out? You want to hang out? You want to hang out? Want to hang out? Um, might as well just go in. Okay. I don't have any money, so no point in. I'm honestly surprised at the palace this time. Everywhere we looked was just desert. Oh yeah, all the other ones until now have just been normal cities outside of the distortion itself. Thanks to that, we didn't even know we were in a palace our first time going into Kamoshidas. That's still part of the palace, though. The city may not have been distorted, but it was cognition. The palace rulers may have been criminals, but they were social enough to know the city layout. But Futaba probably doesn't. In fact, I'd bet she isn't even interested in the outside world. Hence why the whole thing is a bleak desert. Understandable, considering her lifestyle. I doubt many famous criminals are shut-ins like her, though. What about that, uh, Wiki WikiLeak guy? It's kind of a shut-in. Hopefully that means we won't have to go through all this desert business in the future. I guess a lot of people don't classify him as a criminal, though. That might not necessarily be the case. Many upper-class citizens travel by limo or plane, so they don't know or care about city life. A plane? Damn, that sounds pretty good. I mean, wouldn't you want to go to a palace way up above the clouds if you could? Didn't we just do that with Kanashira? I think a flying bank is quite enough, thanks. I have to say, though, the topic of the area outside the distortion is fascinating. Depending on the criminal, there may be an exact replica of Tokyo within their palace. I would love to examine the aesthetics of such a strange place at least once. Huh. You don't got a damn thing but art in that head of yours, huh? I think we call that, a uh, passion. But it's true that an observant criminal could have a true-to-reality city in their palace. Although even if such a place did exist, it's not like we'd have any use for it. Alright, talk, talk, talk. Time to go. No more yakking. Let's start our strategy meeting. All right, great meeting, guys. Really uh, found right. out a lot from that. I'm gonna bust loose. I think I'm gonna switch up uh, Ryuji for someone. Maybe. Um. Oh. Oh no. You didn't forget anything, did you? Okay, let's begin. Who should we switch him out for? 
Let's switch out. All right, I never thought I'd do this, but Makoto's gonna have to go for a little bit. Just because she's not high level. I don't have a high confidant on her. Huh? Yeah. Sorry. Don't hate me. All right, let's use that treasure demon thing. Um, where is it? This is a chance of encountering treasure demons. Yes. Huh. Hopefully that does something. Hey. Hmm. Sure we don't. Sure. No point going into Valva Room. I couldn't afford any of the personas anyway. So let's just get in it. I can feel it. Oh, that looked weird for a sec, didn't it? Kind of like high techy. Let's find another way in. Hmm. For real? I'm turning the AC on after this episode. It's so hot. Christ. The downstairs is probably like a good 15 degrees colder. Are you leaving? Come back here. Let's talk for a moment. Okay. Welcome back. I had thought I would never see you again. Yeah, oh, uh, I wonder why. I can't believe you tried to crush us with an effing boulder. You want us to steal your goddamn treasure or not? Hmm, why don't we make a deal? You wish to proceed further, yes? Yo, I wonder if uh, you get different interactions with the house rulers depending on who's in your party. A deal, you say? No, okay, nope, nope, that just confirmed now. There is a town nearby. I would like you to take back that which the bandit there stole from me. Oh yeah, I think I remember seeing a town on the way here. If you bring what was stolen back to me, I will give you a reward. I'll even tell you how to proceed. Can't you tell us any more details? Anything about this bandit or what was stolen? You'll learn all the information you need to know once you arrive. Oh, lovely. We'll need to head outside if we want to go to the town. We can go when you're ready, Joker. Right, let's go now. We gotta steal, steal some uh, shit from Aladdin. Hmm. Yes. We literally just looked at it. Okay. You guys have a uh, short-term memory loss or what? Hey. What do you want to do? Has anyone ac ever actually been to the desert before? Like a legit desert? I wonder what it's like to hallucinate. Like, I know that's like such a stupid thing to ask, but hmm. I think it'd be cool to try once. I have something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you can do shrooms and shit, by the way. It's not what I'm talking about. Oh, spooky. Show me your true form! I think I have one of these. It's weak to fire. We're about even time. You can aim for their weak attack. That did zero damage. Go! Not over yet! Panther. All right, let's grab this boy. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought we got him. I am thou. Thou art I. Yeah, I guess we already have one. Oh, lovely. Um. Get rid of Moon. 
Not bad. We can worry about confidence later. We're not going to do any confidence until we finish this palace anyway. So, just get rid of all okay. the weak ones. I can feel it. Why can I not cover here? The fuck? I have something. Hello? Gun. I'm the best. Easy. Serves you right. Uh, we definitely don't have this guy. Just look at it. Try calming its nerves. Um. Wow. Come on. Um, I want to cherish you. It's timid, right? It probably wants to hear that shit. Aha! Uh -huh. I'm an expert. Alright, let's get rid of a uh, angel. Your power is incredible, Joker. We're just gonna get rid of the weakest ones. Well done on your new skill. Oh wow, level three persona. Right. How handy. Huh. Get rid of this thing. Alright, where's this guy with the key? What are you doing, Aladdin? Get over here, man. What? Wait. That was stupid skull. So this guy's actually kind of weird. You have to literally uh, take certain routes to reach him. Where is he anyway? There you are. Huh? Oh, we gotta corner him. Um. Okay. Exactly. Well. Be smart about it. Hello. Oh, that was easy. Yes. That was a lot easier than I remember. guy's kind of big. Um, one second. I want to change something real quick. Let's see. Let me just do a little adjusting here. Make the game a little louder. It's kind of quiet. Alright, let's find what this guy's weak to. You should check it Hold on. Probably guns, right? Or not. Oh, sick wind attack, bro. Okay, we know it's not. We know winds isn't gonna do anything. Oh. Nope. 
Persona. Come on. Get ready. Oh, that's good, at least. Persona. Right, let me find a good champ. Uh, Persona, I mean. Kimki. Oh, this shit's gonna hurt, boy. You're mine. We're all knocked down. That man got destroyed. Ready to go. Time to finish this. No, 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 no showtime. I'm only using showtime when I need it. You want to talk, buddy? Boobs aren't getting through. Okay. Just die then. Not bad. Not bad at all. Power courses through me. I've awakened to a new power. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's actually really good. That's actually insanely good. Nice. All right. Not bad at all. It's probably why there's a palace, man. Alright, let's get back to the fucking... Too toasty in here. Get back to that nice air-conditioned pyramid. Yes. God is hot. Hot, hot, hot. We're back. This is the thing you said they stole, right? Well done. It is yours now. Wait, what? Didn't you want us to get it back because it's important? That is a map of the tomb, stolen by the bandit to aid in his ransacking of this place. Uh, it looks like a big map. Why are you letting them just do whatever they want? This is your palace, isn't it? All that matters is that the map is now yours. Just come further in and... Oh. What in the... Huh? A Futaba-chan dis... Money? God damn it! Oh no no no! It! Is this? Uh oh! Quicksand! Everyone, swim with all your might! Hey, you guys still alive? Ow! Wait, how did they get out of quick? Wait, what? Quicksand? Aren't you not supposed to swim? First a boulder, then this. Uh, did we piss her off somehow? I don't think it has anything to do with us angering her. I suspect the problem is that she can't control her instinct to push people away from her. Simple defense mechanism. Considering what she's been through, I don't blame her for mistrusting others. Joker, let's save her. We've got to help Futabachan open the door to her heart. Are you sure about that? I thought we'd just leave. I have no objections, but we should worry about ourselves first and foremost. Come on, let's look for a way back above ground. Otherwise, this place is going to end up our tomb, too. Hmm. Yeah, my memory of this place is hazy. I have something. Very hazy. All I remember is that there's um, some shadows who are really... Really stupid. Like they just one shot you. I mean that literally too. Like literally their ability is insta kill. Get your lanky ass out of there. Show me your true form. Now that kid's distract! Go! 
Hello. I think I have one of you. Stay alert. Curse attack for time. You can aim for their weak spot. Let's go. Maybe you can hit their weak point. Do I really not have a new fear for some? Oh my god. That's stupid. Do it. Not over yet. Whoa, what the fuck's Ryuji having his hand? This thing looks crazy. Whoa. Um, what am I shooting with this gun, by the way? Come on. You don't that you don't think that's just overkill? Nice work, team. I would disagree. A new move? Awesome! Check out this new skill! Ooh. Heavy physical damage to one foe. I'll switch that out. <laughs> Easy. I want to show I'm not missing anything. Oh ho ho! Look, a tr invincible Ophida. Hmm. No idea what that does. Gotcha, bitch. That one of your gunfire gets through its defenses. Watch yeah. your remaining ammo. You see, it's their weakness. It's all too easy. Um, okay, that was really easy. <laughs> okay, guys. I didn't do that much damage. Alright, let's try again. Okay, guys. Relax, buddy. Aha! Uh -huh. A spectacular victory! Excellent. Not too bad. Apparently somewhere we haven't been over here. Yeah, we got all of it. Focus. Wait, how did I get up? Oh. I gotta go back down. I see. Wait a second. There the that's my CPU doing that thing again. It's so weird. I don't know what that is. I can feel it. Sorry about that. A week too? Not that. Electricity is its weak point. Come. This should be no problem for you. Pixie! I was still gonna kill him. Looking cool, Joker! Go ahead. Alright, there, Mike! Carmen! Confirm! You got your weak point! 
taking this, Panther. Okay, guys. That really doesn't do that much damage. My turn. So the big guy deal from. Where are you? There you are. Oh, that seemed like dude, that did a lot of damage. Okay. Easy win. They were nothing. They were nothing. Let me tell you. It's another fucking dead end. It's somewhere. It's funny they they can't see you somehow. I don't know how that works, I'll but... Reveal your true form. <laughs> oh, these things are new. These guys don't... These guys look like they'd be weak to... Maybe... Psionic. Go down. Okay. Okay, that was easy. Just a chill, man. It's uh, even though it's like a thousand degrees in here. Damn it! Why am I so shit at these now? Looking cool, Joker. Damn it, I fucked that up so bad. I literally just misclicked. Alright, let's try again. This one seems gloomy. Don't say anything too forceful. Okay, we won't say number two. Um, that isn't forceful, is it? I guess it is. <laughs> Damn it. Queen Futaba. <laughs> Listen, we already have a queen on our team, okay? Alright, buddy. Okay. I can feel it. I'm going for every little bit of money we can, because we are broke. We are broke, bitches. Dove. Yeah. True. Well, this guy's high level. I'll reveal your true form. What the hell? All right. The first move is ours. Okay. Where is that thing located? I'm not done. Just relax, Joker. Give me a second. Getting so howdy. Hasty. Um yeah, let's see what this guy's weak to. Go down. He doesn't have that much health. This is such a good ability, I don't think we need to use it though. So expensive. Oh. 
Just casual almighty damage. Nothing wrong with that, right? <laughs> Kidding. Oh, there it is. What is that? Alrighty. I mean, we'll just keep hitting him with the same shit. Joker. Chanting Baboon, level 36? Christ, what the hell? Why is he so high level? That's straight ridiculous. Alright. Okay, we're done. I know this episode's going a little long, but we'll be out of here soon, don't worry. Or we won't, because I actually remember this guy now. Yikes. Hey. Hmm. Yeah, that guy actually is really annoying. Oh, an enemy. I'll reveal Tough your one. true form. The first move is ours. Ooh. Thank you, Akechi, or a uh, counselor. I forget who it is. Persona! You're mine. <laughs> this guy's got a lot of health. I think this is Anubis. Oh, you got shocked. That's good. Oh, dude, no damage or whatever. Um, yeah, lucky punch. That's why we do those. Uh, I don't think we checked his fire yet. Nope. I like we just keep hitting this guy over and over. It's like, you'll die to something. You'll die to something. Okay, he's resisting to Psy. Good to know. Bro, this dude's so tanky. Do us proud. Wait, who are you doing it with? Oh, no, 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 no. Why, why haven't I seen the Ryuji Makoto one? Do they need to be in the party? Come on. Let's go. There. A spectacular victory. Tanky motherfucker. Leveled up. I'd like to try this skill soon. Uh, medium physical damage off post. Why does everybody have physical attacks? Why is there so many of those? Okay. I can see it. They were nothing. More money. Alright, we are getting out of here. Except for this guy. I can see it. Show me your true form. Alright. The first move is on. Um, okay. You're mine. Looking cool, Joker. Yours. Not over yet. I want to get that guy, those two guys on the side, because I don't have them yet. It's almost scary how good I am. It's almost scary how good I am. All right, come on, buddy. Give me your power. 
that one looks pretty gloomy, Bye. but don't overthink it. Just go say hi. I'm um, green. Are you a fool? Hmm. Huh. You think maybe a little reverse psychology. Hmm. I see. Aha. Uh -huh. I am thou. Thou art I. Masochist persona. What should we get rid of? What is that there? Naga? No. Let's get rid of Priestess. That's a new one, isn't it? Okay. Uneasy feeling. Oh. Good. I haven't had one of those in a while. Excellent. <sighs> yeah, I'm in the same place as you right now, man. <laughs> it's somewhere. All right, definitely time we're gonna stop oh, this episode, this. make a manual save, so I don't make the same Final Fantasy mistake. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching as always, and uh, see you next episode.